Hi, Paul. Hey. Money won't buy us happiness. No. But it'll buy us an e-bike. Mm. Hey y'all, Rip One Outdoors here. I wanted to show you my little contraption that I built to haul my Magic Cycle Cruiser up in the back of my truck. Uh, looking at maybe later on getting a, a rack to put in the hitch back here. Uh, looking at one of those Swagmans um, that are RV approved. Maybe I can haul it back there on my RV too. But for now, I just wanted to rig something up temporary that I can haul my bike up to the uh, lo local uh, area here and make a couple of videos. So there you go. That's four, four treated two by fours that I bought. And I got them from the discount rack at Home Depot. Uh, the crossboards this way, 20 inches long. And my fat tire fit right down in it. And to use to hold the wheel from going side by side, you got a two by four laying down, two by four standing up. I can't tell you how long to make the pieces that are going across because those are gonna have to fit your truck, whatever. I, I know mine, I just bobbed them off. Hey, but it doesn't move. I tied it down with some little, uh, they're not ratchet straps, they're the uh, tension straps, I guess. You push a little button and relieve the tension. Bought them at Harbor Freight for $13. $23.08 for the 2 fours, $13 for the straps from Harbor Freight. Hey, there you go. Worked fine. And I tie two off back here. I've already took them off. I tie one. I tie it up here to my rack. And uh, it doesn't have to be that tight. But it held, it held during the ride up and back. Never, it never shimmied or sh shook or anything. So there you go. I hope that'll I hope that'll be a help to you. I I picked up this idea from Citizen Cycle on YouTube, and uh, if you're on here, I I, I appreciate your uh, putting uh, uh, info out there. And I built it for myself, and it works fine. And um, I got a little ramp here that I'm using. This is a Ford F250, so it's pretty high. But I got a little ramp here that I'm using. That's the ramp that I put my, load my. Uh, lawn mower up in the, uh, my shed and all with but hey it works good I push it up and I stop the back wheel right here I let the I let the uh, kick stand down and then I then I step up in the bed of the truck push it up in there and it pretty much stays it stays upright until I can get my straps on it hook the straps on the handlebars there hey we good to go. We good to get on down the road. Hope it helps. I've got an extra board there built in case I ever haul two bikes. But right now I just use the one that's in the in the uh, center there. So like and subscribe, and we'll catch y'all on the next one.